This uh, means a lot to me. I know it means a lot to all of you guys. Everybody here has uh, has a story to tell about how much Bob means to them. I don't know. I don't have any way I could ever express how grateful I am to commemorate this amazing little man. Right. Well, here's the moment then, guys. Bob is forever a part of Islington. We've made our mark on this on this uh, place, and Bob has definitely earned it. I'm proud of him. Every single day that Bob and I were, you know, selling the big issue and you know sleeping rough and things like that, I, they're permanently ingrained in my memory. It's all very cathartic. From um, this is this is the place where the first lines were penned, where the book first came out on fifteenth of March, um, where Bob and I used to have our lunch every day before the books, um, and now to have this very spot here, it's amazing. It's something special. I am Tanya Russell, and I am the sculptor of the tribute to Bob. How did I feel about seeing the unveiling today? Um, I was quite nervous just because it's. You know, it's such an important sculpture in that it's portraying a story that is so important to so many people um, and the fans have so much love for Bob and James that it was really important for me to try and capture the real essence of Bob. I think the statue is wonderful, a, a good likeness, especially the way the eyes um, look, at, look at you. They seem to be looking straight at you. Bob had such wisdom in his eyes. Thanks to James and Bob, I've made lots of, of like-minded friends. And it's thanks to James and, and Bob, Bob that I, I understand about the big issue, actually. Bob is always a little friendly cat. All the kiddies love, love a bit of Bob. Uh, there's a lot of cat lovers in the area, so the uh, statue will mean a lot to them, I think. Yeah. Bob is definitely here. I mean, he's actually, I've got his ashes upstairs at the moment. So um, yeah, I brought him along because I thought he should be here to see his own statue. Mm -hmm.